The latest bomb attack in Taba and the threat against tourists by Ansar al maqdis group caused an uproar in Egypt. Tourism was beginning to pick itself up after three years of near collapse. The last three months witnessed a 31% rise in tourists than the previous two quarters. But what is the aim of these attacks? All of this is considered to be desperate moves. I mean, it's, it's all coming towards the end and they're very desperate and uh, they're targeting the Egyptian economy. I mean, the name of that group supposed to be uh, supporting uh, Jerusalem. What does blowing up a, a tourist or targeting a tourist in Egypt does to Jerusalem's case? It's totally irrelevant. So uh, that's totally uh, uh, targeting Egypt, the new Egypt. Tourism is a major source of badly needed hard currency for the government. A drop in tourism would mean more burden on a budget already facing a huge deficit and high debts. No countries have so far imposed travel bans on Egypt after the latest developments, but they asked travelers to remain inside hotels and resorts. Meanwhile, the Ministry of Tourism announced that there are minimal cancellations from tourist groups. We've been through this many times before, and actually the last group of tourists I had with me uh, a few days ago, when we discussed these things, they told me we will still come to Egypt because if we don't, then the terrorists have won. And they're telling me that the more tourists they come to Egypt, this is declaring that we are winning against the terrorists. And I'm sure the world is with Egypt in this war. Egyptians are bracing for the 20th deadline by the militants. For now, security has been tightened on tourist sites and efforts are underway to avoid a repeat of the Taba incidents. Yasser Hakim for CCTV, Cairo.